time again when the Super Eagles of Nigeria are gathered once again for an international window. Yes, it's a double header against Libya. The Super Eagles of Nigeria are gathered again. They are flying over they are flying over as we speak from different parts of the world to gather again at Ecolet Penel. That's their home base at four points by Sheraton for the double header they have to execute against Libya. That is the first game for Nigeria at home in the, at the nest of champions. Go to the stadium will hold on the 11th of this month. The players are entering as we speak. I am a Super Eagles camp today is Monday, 7th of October. We are expecting four players to be in camp. They are coming to Accra Bonsita on the afternoon flight. Their names are, I can't reveal their names immediately, but we four players to be in camp at the end of today. And about seven to eight other players are expected to arrive tomorrow. We might not have a full house on Tuesday, but by Wednesday we expect to have a full house of players present. We are still hoping that we can get a full house by Tuesday. I don't know what every Nigerian fan is expecting that every boy that watches football for now and wants the best for Super Bowl will be hoping to get a full house by, by Tuesday, but I expect that this will happen 100% by Wednesday. At this current moment, the biggest news coming out of camp is that Starboy Victor Osimen is not going to be in this camp. This news ordinarily should cause apprehension, fear, discomfort to the average Nigerian fan. We remember the past results of our last four World Cup, FIFA World Cup qualifiers where we manage three draws and one and one loss. However, the Super Eagles remember are a talented bunch of players, players playing at the very peak of their careers. So in the striking position we have those invited to camp. We have Victor Boniface, amazing form in, in Germany. We have Tawa Wani tested and trusted over time. And then the player that replaces the player that replaces Victor Simon directly, Chibaya AGK dubbed the Nigerian Neymar any day, any time. Probably the best jubiler across all five again across all top five leagues in Europe at the moment. So Super Eagles are still fully, fully stocked at the moment. I will still expect victory no matter how it turns out. Remember, the, the Libyan side is embroiled in their own crisis. They're having managerial issues, trying to sort it out. So it's a perfect time to play Libya ordinarily. But the Republic also said at the last international break that it's a perfect time to play Nigeria. We are not sorting out our coaching issues. And they came here and they collected three for good measure. Maybe Libya has no collect. Libya so football is very very funny, we don't know how it's going to swing, but I'm just here to tell you that we are guarding again in camp and we are in front of the four point by Sheraton and I'll be bringing you all the updates as it happens. Some players are in Nigeria at the moment, some are flying in at the moment, but all things, all things being equal, we will have a well but if all things being equal, a lot of players will be in camp between today and tomorrow and the first official training of, this, of the team is going to hold tomorrow at the nest of champions of the Boston Apagro International Stadium at the training pitch, so just stay locked. Let us do this camping together. I have exclusive interviews planned for you guys. I have a one-on-one -on -one sit down with the coach. Hopefully, I'll give you all the content you need on this channel. Stay locked on this channel and let's just enjoy the camping experience together.